hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm back with another video and in today's video i do have quite a nice sized haul video for you all so the first thing that i'm going to begin with are some shaped sequence glitter that i did purchase at michael's so this is a variety of different places and this is 30 grams i thought it was super super cute the design was um like mermaid theme or under the sea i'd say so I'm going to go ahead and just show you what it incorporates. So it's a mixture of like um, mermaid tails, starfish, I guess you could say, and like hexagon glitter. So it's really nice, the combination. And there's also some seashells as well. It's really cute seashell here. They're on the bigger side. You can always cut them in half. I'm definitely going to use this for encapsulation. Um, but yeah. It also brings a seal, which is nice. Foam seal. And I believe these were like $2.49. They were very inexpensive. And Michaels always has in the front of their door when you walk in, they always have a coupon code that you can um, put at checkout. Self-checkout that they have there. So the next one that I got are some shaped, shaped clay or polymer slices. And these are 40 grams in... Um, little flowers which is super cute as well and you have a mixture of different colors i love to utilize this for encapsulation for any nail enhancement you could do it through acrylic build your gel poly gel or the lazy girl method or you can put it on top as well it's honestly up to you and these are super cute and you get all this amount and i believe this was 249 as well and sometimes if you go on michaels.com, the website, they have exclusive ones that are only online of like um, exclusive glitter, shaped glitters, and polymer slices. So it's always nice to check that out. Another thing that I went ahead and got at Michaels was just a shaped glitter pack. And it does bring 12 different separate glitters, which is nice. And what I love about it is that you just cut it on here and then it's resealable, which is nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this with the scissor like it says. And I like how I could reseal it at the end. You can see. It's like a zip log. You can take this out. This does bring 12 packs and each pack is has entails 24 grams of the glitter and this is all shaped glitter for encapsulation of nail art which is what i'm using it for but of course you could use it for whatever you'd like some of them stayed stayed behind so i have to go ahead and grab those and this one oops i'm sorry i moved the camera caps these two stayed behind as well so this is what it looks like now I'm gonna go ahead and show you each individual one. So the first one that we have are these really tiny hexagon glitters and they are um, iridescent, which is really pretty for like a Halloween look or something like that or any versatile look. Then we have the same hexagon mini, mini hexagon shaped glitter in pink and it is, um, What was that? What was the word? I forgot. <laughs> but the same thing I said for the last. And then we also have this yellow one as well. Very nice. And we also get... Well, this one is mixed with fine glitter. So that's really nice as well. I love all these glitters. I got so happy when I saw them. And I'm obviously going to organize them in another video. But um, I'm not going to keep them in these packs. You can if you want. But Then we have 
these mixed glitter hexagons like medium shape or sized and then here we have a mix of small tiny hexagons with larger sized ones which i really like so you can do a lot with these definitely check out your nearby michaels i have one like five minutes away so i definitely i don't know why i didn't go sooner but here we also have another really beautiful mix and this is definitely a halloween mix so pretty and then we have another mix here and this definitely can be used like as an easter type of mix and then here we have another mix and this one also has stars in it which i like you can't really see but there are stars as well in here then we have this really beautiful glitter mix of stars and hexagons the different sizes which is really pretty these would look so good encapsulated then we have some hearts iridescent hearts which are real pretty i like how everything's iridescent and then lastly for this pack we get black and white um glitter mix which is really pretty as well and then you could either put them back in here, which I won't be. Um, or you can put them back in the Ziploc. So it's really nice because you get the option. And then eventually I will go ahead and um, after the video, I will be placing them in the Ziploc bag that it comes in. But for now, for you guys could see, I will just be laying it like this. And next, I did get another one. It is 12 pack. Once again, 12 pack of glitter, shaped glitter, and it is um, 24 grams. Oh, okay, they're 24 grams total, not each. I'm sorry. So total, 24 grams. It's 0.84 ounces each little bag. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this. So here we have these, and then I'm going to start with the first one, which are some iridescent yellow stars. Then, oops. then we have iridescent puzzle pieces, which is super nice, love that. Then we have stars in orange. And I believe these were like four dollars for each pack, which was really inexpensive. It was either three or four dollars. I don't remember, but it was not expensive. And then we have some puzzle pieces again, and like an orange. Then we have some big, bigger shaped hearts. Which is nice. Then we have some pink puzzle pieces and iridescent. Then we have some baby blue iridescent stars. Some more puzzle pieces in blue, like iridescent purplish, bluish. We have some iridescent purple hearts. We also have some purple iridescent. These are like camo, kind of, because they kind of change color shifting, actually. Um, puzzle pieces, like purple, bluish color. The same with some hearts, purple, bluish. And then lastly, from that pack, we have iridescent green stars. And then lastly for glitter, I did get one more bundle for this video. I think I have more that I purchased, I don't remember, but for this video, um, that's what I have. Let me see here. Oh, 
Okay, so here we have some purple, irid not iridescent, they're just purple flowers. We have some irid iridescent yellow flowers. Super pretty. We have some yellow ones, like some sheer yellow ones. Is cool. We have some really cool transparent looking flowers and then some other like translucent pink flowers. This is like something I would see in jellyfish fields on Spongebob or something. I love that. Then we have some more flowers in purple, different shape. We also have some blue flowers. We have some sheer blue flowers. Some reddish flowers. We also get some purple ones, purple iridescent ones. And lastly from the pack, we have some green leaves, green golden leaves, which is really nice. Love everything. So that's from what I have from Michael's. Then from the Dollar Tree, I have this really cool... I'm like, you know what? I was at the craft section. I always wanted to get into doing watercolor nails with a watercolor palette. So I said, you know what? I just saw a mini watercolor palette with 15 colors. And it includes the brush and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and try it for nails. And that's exactly what I did. So I'm definitely going to go ahead and try this out with you guys here. Because I want to see if it's worth it or not. Even though it's a dollar to five, regardless, it's not a loss or anything, but I wanted to try it out. So I'm here to try it out for y'all to see if it's worth getting or not. But this is a water palette. It was only a dollar twenty-five. I mean a watercolor palette. And they are non-toxic colors, and it brings a lot of colors, 15, which is great. And it also brings a brush. So I'm just gonna go ahead and try it and see if it is worth buying. I thought it would be a great idea to show you because hey, maybe it's great and you can go and get yourself one. Okay, now I see that it works. So yeah, you gotta use water for this because the alcohol is making it difficult to work with. But they work. And I'm so happy about it. I put way too much water on there, but oh my gosh, this is so cool. This literally works. Look how cool it is. You can have your own watercolor nails. And I used to actually buy the inks, but now you don't have to. You don't have to waste money in my inks because you could use watercolor. And you don't even need the alcohol, honestly. But I want to create like a different design. So I'm just going to go ahead and spray some alcohol because I want to do like an actual nice design now. Okay, so. And I'm going to definitely pour some of this out. It has way too much. Okay. So now that I poured some water out, I'm just going to go ahead and show you a very nice design really quickly that you can do. They're very painted. Done love. I'm going to just remove the color on here. And wipe it down there. I'm gonna do that with like another blue. And this was only a dollar. It's crazy. And I think 
think I'm gonna do like maybe a hint of yellow. I think that looks so pretty. I'm gonna just be sitting here doing a bunch of designs. Cause I love it. This is so beautiful. I am so happy that I just showed you guys this because it looks really nice and I'm just so happy. I just get so stoked every time I find something that is affordable and I'm like, okay, now, you know, all of my supporters can literally learn how to do this. Well, you guys are family to me, but you know what I mean? You know, my YouTube family can definitely go ahead and learn how to do this now and they can go to the Dollar Tree and now they don't have to stress about having to buy these inks that cost all this money because you can use a watercolor palette from the Dollar Tree that's only $1.25. So I get really excited over this type of stuff. Which is why I'm usually there trying to find, um, you know, things that I could show you guys. And this looks beautiful. I'm going to let this air dry um, because that design is so done. Because I love the way it looks. And I'm just going to go ahead and do some more swatches if you guys don't mind. Because I want to do some more cute, fun designs. I fell in love with this idea. I don't know. So now I just want to do it. I hope you guys don't mind. I'm sorry. I just want to do some other designs to show you. I'm just going to be showing you. How this is drying and it looks so cool. Look how nice this looks. Just letting it dry before I top coat it. Okay, while the rest are drying, I'm gonna go ahead and work on this one now. And so I'm gonna go ahead and do like a like a purplish one now. Okay, so here it did like a purple and black. And now I'm gonna work. I didn't really like that one, but you know, just trying to do different designs. Now I'm gonna do like a fuchsia pink. like a fuchsia pink with like maybe like a yellow oh that looks pretty I 
That looks very, very pretty. I love this one. This one I just didn't really like for some reason. So I'm gonna go ahead and add maybe like white. Okay, this looks a little bit better. But yeah, um, this is the last one. I didn't really like this one. So I'm not going to really include this one because I just don't like it. But I definitely want to go ahead and show you my other watercolor ones. That were so pretty. I absolutely love them. They're gorgeous. And as you can see here... They work like a charm and you can do all types of designs and mixes with your watercolor. So these are really cool. I absolutely loved and loved, loved them. This one I didn't like. I'm not a fan of so I'm not now. And I wanted to show you how durable these napkins are that nothing went through my desk and I dealt with a bunch of colors and my desk is clean. So these are wonderful. I'm definitely going to go back and get some more just because, you know, when you find good things, you have to stock up on them. But anyway, so now we're going to start off with some things from Timmy Shein and AliExpress. So it's like a mixture of a bunch of places, except for Amazon. I didn't get anything from there. Look how beautiful these charms are. I absolutely love Look how beautiful they are. They're sparkly. They're actually shimmery. And they're so beautiful. I love these. And it brings like a whole bunch. <clears throat> we have those. Next, we have... These are really cute, like little cartoons or like dolls. I like these little ice cream pops. these really tiny adorable um donuts kind of flip them over because they have different designs Some of them have faces on as well. They're all different. I love that. So you have a variety of different donuts. And then there's like some in here as well. I love the detail on them. Characters. 
Oh, we have this cute little pineapple as well. They're like all flipped over. But yeah, that's what we have here. So cute. One of them fell. It was this really cute one. So adorable. <laughs> Okay, so next we have these really cute charms. They're like adorable. Well, these are really pretty. They're like a mixture of some clouds, sparkles, crescent moon with sparkles. These are very, very beautiful. Absolutely love these. And half of them just fell everywhere. What's new? Okay, I'll pick them up. You know, I always say I'll pick them up later and I never do. Here I have some leaves. This is something new. Um, they're just individual leaves and they're really pretty. Some of them are shimmery, some of them aren't. I love them. I thought they were really neat. There's a variety of like different leaves in here. Next we have we have some like moon. I like some galaxies, I think these are as well. Planets. Next, we have these really cute cats. I'm picking that up later or after. Because it's so annoying. They always fall everywhere. I don't even know why. I also have these little Christmas charms, which are really cute. Most of them are like, choose mm. to see them. Super cute. And here we have some, I don't know why they put it in a packet like this and then a zip off. Just have some, that one, some of the photos missing. But yeah, you just have some pineapples. Um, here you just have some really miniature um, sunflowers, which I thought were really cute. 
And lastly, I have um, a sprinkle nail polish that's vanilla scented from the Dollar Tree. And I'm gonna swatch it and smell it to see if it is scented. So this is what it looks like, and it is a ML by B Color. It's a dollar twenty-five. Okay, so it's not vanilla scented. It just smells like nail polish, in my opinion. I don't know. But I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it anyways. It seems like a milky, sprinkly consistency that you would see like on a glazed donut or like on an ice cream, which is nice. I love it. It's very creamy. Like milky. With sprinkles on it, that looks so cool. I love how it has sprinkles. Look at the sprinkles. This is so nice. I hope you guys can see the sprinkles on camera, but it's very neat and I love that really pretty i love that i love the consistency it's very nice so next we have some more charms these are just some ice cream cones with some smiley faces on them Ooh, these are super pretty. They're like part ones. Look how beautiful these are. We have these really pretty flowers. And that is it for today's haul. Thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell to get notified every single time I upload. Subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know down below what were your favorite items. What did you enjoy mostly about today's video? Or have you guys gone shopping lately for nail stuff? Let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support. I love you all and I'll see you in the next upload.